Wales has had a devolved government since 1999, following the successful 1997 referendum. The road to devolution had been long and complex, and the referendum was not the end of discussions on Welsh autonomy, but did mark the beginning of a change in Welsh politics and national identity. The 1998 Government of Wales Act laid the groundwork for the National Assembly for Wales to meet for the first time in 1999. The Act included several core values, such as a commitment to equality, sustainable development, and equal treatment of both the Welsh and English languages. The Assembly was initially only able to make secondary legislation in a few areas such as agriculture, education, housing and highways. Secondary legislation refers to law created by ministers or other bodies that are used to provide details for primary legislation, also known as Acts of Parliament. In 2007, following the third Welsh general election, the National Assembly was formally separated from the Welsh Government due to the updated 2006 Government of Wales Act giving the Assembly the ability to make primary legislation for the first time. The separation between the two was also intended to further establish the roles of the Assembly and Government, setting Welsh ministers as decision-makers with the ability to develop and implement policy, and Assembly members to scrutinise and approve their actions. The Welsh Government is a devolved government formed after a UK general election, whereas the Assembly is a body democratically elected by the people of Wales to hold the Welsh Government to account. In 2011, a further devolution referendum voted in favour of granting the Assembly more primary legislation powers in areas it had control over, such as housing, environment, culture and education. These powers were further expanded with the Wales Act 2014, granting the Assembly new financial powers. The Wales Act 2017 then further enhanced the Assembly's powers and finally made it a permanent part of the UK Constitution, protecting it from being abolished by Westminster. In 2020, after 21 years, the Assembly was finally recognised as an established Parliament due to the passing of the Senate and Elections Wales Act 2020. This allowed it to change its name to Senate Cymru, or Welsh Parliament, and gave 16 and 17 year olds and foreign nationals the right to vote in Senate elections. As for elections in Wales, they work slightly differently to the rest of the UK. Residents of Wales vote in UK general elections like everyone else, but from those votes, the devolved Welsh Government is also formed. In addition, Welsh voters are also given a second vote on election day to elect regional representatives who will make up the Welsh Assembly. The two-vote system is intended to ensure that the Senate best represents voters' interests. Alongside these elections to the Senate, Welsh voters also elect local representatives for the 22 principal areas of Wales and vote to elect a police and crime commissioner.